this guy's gonna kill Mans. Let's go, bro. Where's this guy? Yo, E. This guy's gonna kill Mans. Greetings, greetings, greetings. <laughs> oh, a little something like that. Where's this guy? Where's this guy, man? I know, I know, I said to you, I said to you. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> no, I can be ten minutes late. No, I had to, I had to pat, I had to pat a little. No, 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 no. Right, you can't tell me two o'clock. I'm here waiting, huh? No, no, no. Listen, no, it was meant to be two, but I was patting a little man. What are you saying? What are you London or you back in Birms? No, I'm in Birmingham, bro. I'm in Birmingham. Yeah. Yeah, man. Um, you ain't started training yet, have you? No, 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 no. We ain't started. But obviously, we're doing individual work, innit? So I've oh, just come yeah. back here to do some work. Yeah, how's that going? How's, the, how's that going, the individual work, innit? Yeah, it's all right, man. We've been given a schedule, you know, by Aston Villa that we that we need to do every week. So, you know, I'm just taking over. Yeah, that's good. So you was in um, you was in London not too long ago, was you? Like, with family. Now, how's family and everyone? How's your brother and everyone? Yeah, everyone's good, bro, man. Everyone's good, self-isolating, so everyone's good, man. Yourself? Yeah, no, nah, everyone's good, you know. Can't complain. The family's good. Everyone's good in that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait. The comments are key. <laughs> wait, I'll say, go away, bro, man. Yeah, I, I'll say, before I even start, before we even start removing this thing, like, the, the camera angle, the lighting from where you are is even looking good, like, like, right now, the skin colour is even looking caramel. <laughs> so, tell us the ingredients. What you been using? Carolite or what you been using? Am I saying Carolite? Are you crazy? Nothing, bro. Nothing at all. Mm? No, because the skin is looking clear, you know? <laughs> <laughs> hey, chill, man. Chill, 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 chill. Hey, I'm but what I'm saying, remove though. So, but, yeah. How you been finding it at Villa now? What's Villa saying and stuff like that? Yeah, no, it's good, man. Obviously, I'm back working with, with the coach that I was with at Brentford, innit? So, it's all good, man. The level's different, innit? The intensity, the workload, everything's different, man. Yeah. So, yeah. talk to us. Talk to us from um, where you first started. Obviously, for the people that don't know where you're from, and uh, obviously, now they know that you're playing for Villa, but tell them where you started and, like, where you grew up, like, a bit about yourself and your background. I grew up in Kennington, uh, East London, I joined Charlton when I was 11. I was there for nine years. Uh, came through the academy, went into the first team. Played in League One for two years. And then um, I got moved to Brentford. Played for Brentford for one season in the Championship. And then obviously got the move to Aston Villa last summer. No, that's that's good. That's good to hear. Like, did you think, like, obviously, as a youngster growing up, did you think your journey to the Prem would have been a bit longer or like because it happened so quick for us yeah. like, for other people that don't know like it happened so quick like you said you spent two years in um what's it called league one then you went Brentford you played a year then now you're in you're in the prem so like for you how did it feel for it to happen so quick no you know what I've, I've always believed in my, in my ability in it and um I always knew that if, if I was to listen to the coaches and you know, learn every day that I'd get far or go somewhere. And, you know, um, I've, I've had the right support around me, the right mm. people around me that, you know, that have guided me to the right place. So I'm grateful for that. And, you know, I wasn't, I wouldn't say I was surprised. I knew that, you know, if you work hard, you know, your mm. time will come. Yeah. No, that's, that's good to hear. Um, we're saying that, obviously, Back in the days, I used to say, "What is Ezri a centre back or a midfielder? Like, which one are you? Like, which one are you, Ezri? Like, can you just tell us like, which one are you?" You know what? When I first joined Charlton, I started off as a right back. Yeah. Yeah. So I played right back for a few seasons, 
And then I moved to centre mid. And then after a few seasons, you know what? I went into under under 18s. Mm. The manager was like to me, um, how do you feel about going centre half? And I said, you know what? I'll give her a go. And then from there, I just I just stayed at centre half. Mm. But now I'm a centre half. Yeah, centre half. Yeah. Yeah. No, <laughs> no, he's killing me. I've seen, I've seen, like, obviously, I've seen a couple. Um, what's it called? Matches you've played in, played very yeah. well. I even played against you myself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that game. I was, I didn't, I didn't like the way. You, huh? There's even a picture. I think Pindi had it. There's even a picture. You're trying to barge me off the ball. Mom, mom, I'm gonna, yeah. <laughs> You know, you know I what? Even, I even had to tell Pindi, hide that picture, hide that picture. You know what? And the picture's no friends, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, nah, I, I dig that. I dig that. that was, you know what? For everyone that played that game, that's, that was one of my best games, you know? That game yeah. was... Nah, you know what? The, the, the um, second leg at our, our ground, yeah, you was moving warm. Yeah, mm. no, I know. Like, I should have well. scored, though, but yeah, I missed you that. First, first five minutes, I put it wide. First five minutes, put it wide. Under pressure, but it happens, you know what I mean? Yeah, and then after that, that little situation happened. What's the, what's the little guy's name when he head back? Hey, chill. <laughs> <laughs> Sergi, uh, you wasn't on it, you know. You were scared. <laughs> I saw it in your eyes. Oh, no! I, meant, I no, saw that. No, I, I came over. I looked this, into your no, eyes. Listen, huh? Your heart was doing ba-doom, ba-doom. Uh, are you mad? Listen, <laughs> I, I smashed him. I smashed him because he was moving. Then you lot was moving warm. And then he got up. Then he head me. I, like, I didn't I know you had it in oh. you, though, the smashing thing. Like, I said, no, what? I'm on it. Ask anyone. In no, 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 no. Your heart was doing ba doom ba Are you mad? My huh? heart was doing, I was really on it. Uh, maybe, but I, maybe. I was speaking tactical. When he hit but me, I was thinking, mm, should I get up and say I'm on it or should I snake down the red card? <laughs> I tried to do the nah. red card thing. It didn't even work. When I came over, your eyes were like this. <laughs> huh? oh. I said, chill, relax. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Uh, that game was sick, though. What's, what's nah, the um, it was a proper game. Um, when I gave my man the, the little feet. Uh, Moses on the bar, Moses. Joe. Moses. Ah! Nah, nah. I can't know like, what you done to him. Nah, that, that was sick. From, so, from that year, from that year, um, last season, how many people moved yeah. on? Obviously, it was yourself. And who else moved on from Dreadford? Myself. No more pay. Uh, who else? I can't like, I think that's it, you know. Me and no more pay. Yeah, um, this so is no more play. Uh, oh yeah, I remain sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that sorry. was that was that was mad. That was mad still. Yeah, for like the journey's been quick. Like obviously you're you're playing alongside or playing up against people like you know, the Aguero's, yeah. the like the, the like big players, um K D B and that. So when you first come up against them, like how was it? Obviously you was in a tunnel, like <laughs> against anyone anyone in the Prem, anyone like how was you feeling? Like like, no, nah, you know what? Like, when I was feeling like that was coming out of walking out of Old Trafford. Yeah. Yeah, crazy, man. You know, when I was younger, obviously my brother's a Man United supporter. Yeah. So. Big up Gads, um, by the way. Big up Gads. Yeah, big up my brother. And um, when we was younger, we used to watch Man United all the time. Cristiano Ronaldo, Champions League days. You know what I mean? And, you know, walking out of that tunnel was like, fucking you know. hell. Like, you look, you look around and the atmosphere is crazy, man. Was the noise? Like, yeah, mad. it's crazy. Yeah, ninety minutes throughout, the noise didn't stop. Yeah. So what was you nervous or was it? Is it like I always tell people that <coughs> it, even it's gone now. But back in the days, I used to get not nervous. I used to say I used to get butterflies. But as soon as I step over that white line, it's like it's yeah, gone. yeah. No, I'm it's the same. Every, every game, like since I was a little kid, every game I I've been nervous. Like I get butterflies, but then as soon as I step onto the pitch, it just goes. Mm. Yeah, but I think in the Prem, obviously now the butterflies are even more. Do you know what yeah. I'm saying? My first time in the Prem, and it's like flipping all like, You know what I mean? I used to watch these guys like last last year when I was in the champ, mm. and now this year I'm actually playing against them. So it's crazy. Like, man. like obviously, obviously you're all elite players. Like you're playing in the Prem for a reason. But like I said, is there still times when they say like Aguero? See when you watch you watch like your analysis before the game, Aguero yeah. like shifting off to the side or KDB like doing this. Do you think, like, like go in bed the day before, do you think, eh, hey, <laughs> <laughs> oh, No, what word, word, word. 100%, man. Before, like, before we played City at our ground, obviously, I didn't play the um, the first game at the 80 had. I was on the bench, but the second game at our ground, I played, in it? And obviously, 
we watched um we watched them on clips on Friday, the day before the game. And obviously going to bed, I'm thinking, you know what, like man's going up against Sterling, Aguero, Mares, Silva, Kevin De Bruyne, and Zeus and Yeah. La- don't lie, like you keep saying, like, like, I know your heart was really, I know your heart was really doing the boom, boom, like, yeah, hundred percent, boom, boom, when boom, boom, but huh? when it comes game time, you don't even think about that. No, nah, you don't think about it. You actually don't think about it, man. You you, you got to concentrate on the game, man. You can't think about the nerves or whatever. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So, uh, I know. I hear that. I hear that. I hear that. So, like going into them kind of games, there, like obviously. Like you probably got um someone that you got a chef, you got a nutritionist that probably provides you certain things you should eat and that. Do you still get time to eat like Congolese food or not really? Uh, uh yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Still get time when when I'm at home, get time to eat a Congolese food. So I still enjoy it. Yeah. yeah. Like, what's what's your go-to? What's your favorite though, Ezri? Because right now, Ezri. Right now, when I'm looking at you, you're not even looking Congolese. You're looking like, 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 like you're from a tropical island. Like, where were you? Like, tell the people you're from Congo. Like, tell them right now so they need to know. Yeah, I'm half Congolese and half Angolan. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, that explains their skin complexion. Skin, where? Okay. Uh, so, what's your go-to, what's your go-to food then? Like, if you're going to back your Congolese thing, what's your go-to thing? <coughs> um, I'll go for... Oof. I like the Kwanga Nataba. You see that one there? Dangerous. Kwanga Nataba. You know what? Brit said the same yeah, thing. You know, Brit loves Kwanga. Like, like Brit said the nah. same thing. Like Kwanga Nataba, yeah? Dangerous. Yeah, I'm dangerous. Huh? That one there. Dank, man. Okay, then. Nah, hey. Now, obviously, you're a London, you're London boy. Like, obviously, yeah. Birmingham's another city as well. What's the difference? Like, what's the difference between the cities? Obviously, you grew up in London. You know, like, you got so many things going on in London. Like, what's the difference between the two cities? I know that like, Birmingham, is, people say it's a nice place to go and shop and everything as well. Like, what would you say yeah. is the difference? Or what would you say? You no, know, obviously London's busy, you know, like it's, it's mad busy. But Birmingham's busy as well. Like when you go into town, like, there's a lot of people walking about. They've got um, yeah, as you said, they've got a, a nice few places to shop. Mm. But um, I wouldn't say there's there's much of a big difference apart from the accent, obviously. But um, obviously when you go into town, especially into town, it's, it's mad busy. But I haven't really, you know what I mean? I haven't really been about, been around Birmingham like that. Yeah. So there's not much of a big difference in my eyes anyways. Okay, I hear you. So talk, talking about that, let's let's go back to the football side of things. Now, obviously, there's, you've done like a lot of great things, massive achievements and everything. Like, like, has there been a part in your career where you're thinking, I just want this to happen now for me? Like any setbacks, times when you wasn't playing, injuries... Like, um, oof. I had the injury, but that was when I was proper young, when I was like under 16s. Mm. Um, I was out for five months, but you know what? I've always had like um, a strong mentality, Do you know what I mean? Like, when things like that happen, I always believe that you know, I'll bounce back stronger. So, there hasn't been a moment where I thought, you yeah. know what, like, like this is this ain't this ain't my time right now, but, but I've always. You know what I mean? Kept a positive mindset and, and that's got me through through to where I am right now. Yeah. And I just wanted to ask I just wanted to ask you, how supportive has your parents been within your football career? Because my parents my parents was very supportive, but you know there was times when I was young, like I used to get parents telling me like, Oh, how come um your your mum and your pops never come to watch you play? Like you're you're so good in that and I didn't know how to answer that, but they love they love like they was very supportive. They used to do anything for me. But there was, I remember one time when my mum, the first game she come and watch me was against Cardiff. Cardiff at home, yeah. and I got man of the match. And I um I got um I set up the what's it called the equalizer, and just to see the just to see the smile on her face and how happy she was is like wow. Like this is the first time my mum's come and watch me. And bearing in mind, you know me, I've been playing football for yeah yeah eight, yeah. And it was kind of mad because I used to get when I was a kid, when I was like 16, 17, listen, what? You're so good. And like, how come your mum and that never come and watch you play? And like, like how, how's your parents been with your football career? No, they've been, they've been very supportive. They've been there every step of the way, especially my brother. Um, <clears throat> when I was younger, obviously, my dad used to come to every game, literally every game. 
And obviously my mum, because obviously I've got a little sister, she she would just stay at home. But yeah. Oh, the wife are doing bottom bottom. Yo, big up guys though. I'm just reading off the comments though. As his wife is doing No, as his wife is really doing Kalam right now. I don't even know what happened. Ezri's Wi-Fi. You, man, when Ezri comes back, get onto him. Because I don't know if he's using a dongle or what, because his Wi-Fi is really doing boodum boodum. Hey, <laughs> Saj. Hey, Steffi. You, man. Hey, Gads. Ezri's Wi-Fi, gazy, gazy. Hmm? I think his, I think his, his phone, I think his phone even died. <coughs> that was, <laughs> hey, you man, hey Satch, hey Steffi, you man can never ever get onto me again. Ezri's Wi-Fi, gazy. I'm waiting for this guy to come back on. Hey, right, Gads. Gads. <laughs> I was as this one here, I'm going to get onto him. Because them man be getting onto my Wi-Fi today, I'm going to finish him. A Rebo, Wi-Fi, Gazy. Hey, are you mad? Uh, we're coming back home. We're not done. Let me hold, hold on. Hold on. Hey, where is he? Where is he? Hey, I'm going to finish him today. Uh, I'm going to finish him. I'm going to finish him. Hey, Ezri. Hey, comment on the thing, Ezri. <laughs> are you mad? Hey, Paps. Ezri's using a dongle, you know. No, where's Esri? Where's Esri? Esri, come back right now. <laughs> Are you my way? Let me save this thing. We're coming back on. We're coming back on. I mean, you know what I mean? Things wouldn't be the same. Yeah, no. Big up. Big up cats, man. Big up cats. All the time. Like, we're saying that so, like, going forward in that, the jokers and who's, who's got drip? Who's got the drip? Who's got the drip? Well, in... in... Where Villa, Brentford, Charles. Villa. He's got the drip. Uh, there's a few, you know, to be fair. Uh, nah, you know what? Everyone just is up well, you know, at Villa. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, there's not one person, there's not one person that comes in like, like, brother, like, what's this? Like... <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Yeah, ask Joe and that. I used to get a lot of stick at. At Charlton, man, from my gear, like, I used to come in, like, oh! gazy, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Wake up, yo, you know, yo, slap yo, anything Arrebo, on. Yo, 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 Arrebo, if you're on the thing, tell me even he's K, even right KG. now. Tell me he's drip right now, with the drip gazy. <laughs> what, what do you used to come in? Hey, what oh, do you used to wear? Calm track suits. Sometimes when it's raining, come in shorts, wed. Bov. I was, I was so, bro. bro I'm glad to train him. Who am I going to impress? No, nah, no, nah, I hear that. That's like me. That's like me. That's like me now. Go like, go there. Like, well, you're not going to impress no one. Like, you get me? Well, like, I always tell man when I step outside. When I step outside now, that's when that's when you really see done. Like, when I step outside, that's really like, like, come on, like your bitch. Exactly. Hmm? Exactly. Uh, come on. George's drip was gazy at Charlton, huh? Hey, like, hey, what is drip? His drip was no, nah, but the rebo was quite. <laughs> like, rebo was a drip gazy. No. Oh, okay, I can see him. Yeah, like, go, tell, me, tell me a Rebo's one. Tell me, like, tell me a Rebo's one. A Rebo's one was... I don't know, like, you walk through the change room and everyone would start, be, be like, what the... Like, what is this? What are you doing? <laughs> like, did you get dressed in the dark or what? Huh? <laughs> 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 a Rebo! <laughs> no. 
Gaze. Gaze. Look at him. KG. KG. Yeah, no, no. Hey, no, Edry, no, I feel you on that one. When it's training, when it's training, you're just, you get me, you're going into anything. You get me? You're just going in there. You're exactly. not going to impress no one. There's no one to impress. For real, bro. For real. No one to impress. Okay, but when you, you step out, that, when you step out now. Like, I'm not yeah, going to lie. 100%. Out of all the man them in this chat, yeah? <laughs> and out of all the man them, listen, everyone can dress, but out of all of us, there's some gazy, gazy, <laughs> gazy, gazy dress sets out of the man them. <laughs> no, 100%. 100%. That's for, that's for another talk. That's for another talk. Yeah, that's one other time, man. Joe, I can aye, see Joe aye. getting hurt. Who's got, who's got, who's got the tunes on Smash? Hey, Sanj, be off, man. Um, <laughs> uh, you know what? Jack Grealish's music is good. Mm. Well, yeah, listen to everything, yeah. Yeah, everything. A bit of everything. Are you? Are, do you do the same thing as um, everyone else I've been speaking to? Everyone says that like, when you're in the change room, everyone um, requests or puts in their own tune, so everyone gets a chance of playing their own music before games and stuff. No, we don't do that, you know. We just put on a mix and just listen to it. But sometimes most players just put their own headphones in. Yeah, I hear that. I, I hear that. I hear that. Who's, who's, the, who's the tough nut, hard body challenges? Let me guess. It's Mings. Yeah, yeah, 100%. That's me. I can imagine that. I, yeah, I can 100, imagine. 100%. 100%. Even in training, hard. Yeah, hard. You know what? You change the way you play, isn't it? You know what I mean? So that, that's important. Yeah. Joker. Nah, you love killing me, fam. <laughs> uh, hey, these comments are killing me. Joker. Yeah, 100%, bro, man. 100%. Who's the, who's the Joker? <coughs> I can't lie. I'd say me, you know. Mm, you? Nah, nah, sorry. Sorry. Nah, actually. Yeah, me. Me and... Say John McGinn. Mm. Yeah. Like if you yeah, say if you're saying you if you're saying you everyone's in a lab right now, everyone's in, so make us love right now. Give us Hey right, chill, love. man. You can't put me on shit like that. Right man. Now, chill. Make everyone love. Everyone's in the comments. Well, I don't do love. jokes, bro. I just make people laugh. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I don't do jokes, you know. What's that? <laughs> I, do jokes. I, hey. like I just make everyone yeah, see? Joe, everyone's saying it. Well, I just make everyone laugh. Mm, yeah. yeah, man. Hundred percent. Um, who can you see? Who can you see from after football being a manager or being a coach? Uh, um, are you talking just at Villa or from from my past? Yeah, even from your past. Isn't it? Um, there's a centre half at Charlton. Uh, Jason Pierce. Mm. Yeah, man, he loved it. Like, loves working with the young lads. Loved the young lads. So, I'd say him, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, like you said, you've come up. You, you've come up through the ranks and everything, and that. Like, obviously, you played in basically all the leagues and that. Who would you say has been your toughest opponent? <laughs> it's out of. Aguero and uh, Jamie Vardy. Mm. Yeah, 100%. It's one of yeah. them. Yeah, man, yeah. quick, sharp, in it? Vardy, quick. Mm -hmm. Sharp. Strong as well. He's one of them. You know, when you watch him on TV, like, you think, man, you know what? Like, I, I think I can, I can catch up to him, but when you play against him, yeah, like, myth, long. I, 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 I had, I had, I had things like that myself when I was young. Like when I used to see Lee Catmull, I played against him um, when I was at Sunderland. I used to think Lee Catmull. Like when I'm seeing Henri, I mean, not all the Premiership players run around him. What Lee Catmull? Man, what are we doing? When I played against him, Lee Catmull. Different, it's different, man. General Wall. He yeah, was the General Wall. You know how he wears his shorts like this? Yeah. <laughs> he's not playing like this. He's hey. telling people. He wasn't playing the back. Lee Catmull never used to play a Batman. Like, nah, he was really the general. Yeah, like, general, 100%. Like, like, nah, he was sick. He was sick. He always kept things simple. Man, he, he was... Like, it was effective. Yeah, like, I, I've done that to a lot of people, but when you come up against them, you're thinking, fuck. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Uh, it's different, man, from when you watch them and then when you play against them. 
obviously you're, you're still on your football journey. Yeah. But um, I was going to say the best player that you played alongside. Obviously, you're going to probably play alongside like bigger players or whatnot as your career yeah. moves on and that. But who would you say? Can I pick two or? Yeah, you can pick two. Um, Saeed Ben Rama. Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got his top. I've got his top. <laughs> that guy, that, that, yeah. that guy, they're dangerous. Cra uh, crazy, bro. Crazy. And um, oh. Grealish. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. He, hey, see, like, no, Grealish is hard. Hard. Yeah. Ball. I feel, now, I feel, I feel say, is it Grealish or Grealish? <laughs> what was it say again? Uh, uh, is it Grealish or Grealish? Grealish. Grealish, yeah. Grealish, yeah. People pronounce it different, man. Grealish, yeah. Grealish. But I say Grealish. Yeah, Grealish. Yeah, no, nah, it's hard. Hey, listen, that Benavama guy. Uh, Medi. <laughs> Yo. Bro, I don't know. I don't know, man. Like, the things he used to do in training, like, it was scary. What he like, was scary. Good. Like, a rebound could perhaps, you men are just laughing. Like, you not say it. <laughs> I have to ask Ezri because Ezri plays with him. Like, I want to know, is it Grealish or Greelish? Which one is it? Like, Grealish or Greelish? Greelish. Greelish. Mm. Yeah, when? Greelish. Greelish. Hey, sh hey, show me knows about Ben Rama. I see you call it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Shemi must have played against him. What? Ben Rama's yeah, cold. Yeah, we played against Shemi still love him. <laughs> Hey, um, obviously, like, we touched up on most things in that. Like, um, what was I going to say? Like I said, again, you're still on your football journey. Your yeah. best 11. Your best 11. Okay. Uh, um, in goal, Tom Heaton. Mm. Yeah, right back. Uh, right back's hard, man. So of Moses of the Barjo and El Mohammedi. Mm. Um, I found God of El, El Mohammedi. Obviously, the experience and that. Second and a half, so I go with um. Uh, I say Chris Mepham mm. and Tyro Mings. Left back, I go. Uh, Jada Silva mm. midfield free I'd go Grealish Joe Rebo, Romain Sawyers then front free left I'd go Ben Rama nine I'd put uh, Carlin Carlin Grant mm. on the right I'd put uh, on the right, you know, has to be uh, Adam Ola Lutman. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, that's my that's my eleven. Strong like, eleven. Like Colin, Colin, a rebo. Like, like, stop acting. I know right now behind the camera you're smiling. <laughs> that Ezra even said your name. All of you just are smiling, smiling. Like, let it out. <laughs> Comment on the thing. Smiley faces. Let it out. Said your name. Smile. <laughs> You know them on yeah. SB, like, they're looking at the camera, they're like, oh, he said my name and that. that. But yeah, I let 100%, it out. 100%. I know, yeah. he's, I know he's laughing. No, no, that's a big squad. But that midfield three, that midfield three was hard, man. I could have put John McGinn in there as well. Proper mm -hmm. player, man. John McGinn, baller. No, I, I, Sancho said, me, the 11. Did I read it right? Yeah, you read it right, you know. I can't, like, I can't even argue with him. I don't want to hear his 11. Yeah, no, that one there might... No, no, he's... he's He's gonna do one. Is is these ones coming up? Yeah, bro, well, get him on here, man. Yeah, no, we're saying that like obviously, um, you're an inspiration to a lot of young kids and stuff. What would you say? Um, what advice would you give to the young kids that look up to you and stuff like that? What would you What would you say to them? Stay focused, uh, be humble, and always be willing to to learn. Mm. They're the they're the three things I'd say. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and one thing I think everyone in the um in the comments wanna know that 
like the ingredients for your face is it caramel light or which one is it? Oh, it's <laughs> nothing, you know, it's cocoa bar. Yeah. I mean, what did Eddie say? Hold on. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right, Eddie's killing me, man. Yeah, no, Ed, no, everyone, everyone that's on this thing, oh, I'm trying to get every man to do this thing, man. It's, it's all yeah, for no, man. It's good, man. Cause, man. It's fun, like, you get me? There's yeah, certain things 100%. that, there's certain things that, you know, players are not allowed to say or do, but you see when you come on with me, it's like band, it's like family, it's like... You exactly, joke, like, bro, exactly. There's a lot of interviews man. that people can't be themselves, so I'm just happy that you uh, come you on. man, chill, man. I don't use cover light, man. <laughs> oh, chill. Hey, chill, man. <laughs> No, I'm happy. I'm happy that um, players can come on and just be themselves. You get me? And no, thank yeah, you for coming. No, 100%, on. hundred percent, bro, man. Hundred percent. Ezri, love for today. Take no care. No worries, brother, safe. man. I appreciate you for letting me on. Nah, take care, love, bro. You too, brother, man. Take care. Uh, you lot, be off, man, with the cover light, man. <laughs>